button phone. There we go. So we are now on. We are live. We are live. <laughs> Somebody will tell you we're live very shortly. You can scroll down and see if they have any questions down below that. Like that stuff Let's or whatever. See. Anything exciting happen in the barn today? No, not really. Not That's that I do. Good because Shannon wasn't here. Yeah. You was were taking Shannon's place? Mm hmm. It was a pretty calm day. And you got called in emergency type? Yeah, I got switched Wednesday through Friday. They need help. <laughs> okay. All right. Hmm? Is it my gun? It is. I can help. Behave yourself. <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> What's all got to say today? Seagram and Garnet, right? Oh, okay. We have Seagram right here. This one was the second one, so she's a little groggy. Yeah. <laughs> He's sleepy. <Enjoying> his drugs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a sleepy Seagram. Not really sure what's going on. She's good. Can't quite keep both eyes open. <laughs> Hello, Peg. <laughs> huh? Oh, someone said hu someone said hi. So oh. I said hello. So why are you? Uh, what days are you gonna do? Friday. Tell, tell who you are and why you why you're here. Because go ahead. Um, I'm Olivia. I am doing tram talk today. Be in place of Katie. And I'm gonna be here Fridays and Saturdays. I'll be here tomorrow too. Hello. <laughs> Ready for questions? What did you do today? Um, this morning I was Shannon in the barn because Shannon is in New York, I think. And then I took some dogs out training. I had Regina, Zeppelin, and Cindy. Took Where'd those. Go? Took Regina to the hotel. Um, Zeppelin. We went to CVS and. Cindy, we went to Tractor Supply Company. Any problem with them anywhere? Um, no. Cindy kind of, we tried back up and she kind of panics and just kind of drops down. Oh okay. But other than that. Well, it, some of that could be because usually we ask them to back up into some place and have a lie down so she could have that. She thinks that would be, sometimes they don't realize they're just going to back up and not lie down. Mm hmm Let's get that across to her. Mm-hmm. Um, with me is Haley, Lexi, and Anne. And Anne. <laughs> 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 All right. Um Well. So Who's yeah. the best out of the three that you trained today? Oh, um I'm gonna say Zeppelin. He was pretty good. Pretty. I'll tell you, Merle came back today, and oh. she is wonderful. Yeah? She is doing beautifully. Good. Um, that woman looked out of a clear blue sky, and usually if people don't take her on an airplane, they're all, oh my God, she's going to an airplane. She took her on four flights so far, her first two weeks. Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. Yeah. Oh, she's traveling. She just walked in, and she had to, uh, she had to let her go during going through security. They said, can you walk through by yourself? And she said, oh, sure. So she said, stay there. She walked through, and then she called the dog through. I had a heart attack. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but she made it. She, wow. She it's one of those deals where if you don't expect there to be a problem, there, you know, sometimes you can just keep going. Mm -hmm. And the dog doesn't know it's an airplane anyway. Yeah. yeah. It's a lousy car driver. <laughs> <laughs> I know. That was on a year ago, maybe? Yeah. 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 I know, these ones, like, these ones got so big so fast, too. <laughs> Seagram? They sure have. Lainey is doing well. She is still in laundry. She's not very happy about that, she but... Is, she, she, she runs when I go down there with a the golf cart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she runs up and down. 
No, no, she she runs back into her stall. Oh. oh. Yeah. I don't know why she was doing that. Yeah. Oh. Probably freaks her out in the golf cart. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. A lot of things freak her out. What was your what was your first impression of Crazy Acres and who was your favorite Dane so far? Um Lady. <laughs> yeah. <well. laughs> um, my first impression. Um Hi. It's been a long time ago. How long have you been around? Uh, a year. Yeah. I just started like this time last year. So um, um I don't know, I thought it was really cool, you know, I really liked it, like all the dogs, it was a really interesting environment, definitely not a place I've ever been before, <laughs> one of a kind, so, but I, I liked it a lot, obviously, still here, um, who is your favorite Dane? Laney, <laughs> um, besides Laney, oh, that's a tough question, I'm trying to pick favorites, who behaves best with the three you have? The Zeppelin. He was great. Regina, I like Regina a lot though. She's cute. Her and Kara. I didn't take Kara out, but I had her in the barn this morning. So each out. of you have three dogs? Hmm? Each of you guys have three dogs to play with? We do. Yeah. You do. Um, she's not doing that. Oh, yeah, no, I'm not part of that. I was just taking them out. Oh, okay. What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was going to um, well, the, well, the dogs get a bath with the warm weather. Yeah, uh, me and Shannon just bathe. Digby wait and Jack. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What did you say? <laughs> well, did he, did well. Me and somebody. Oh, me and, oh, no. Shannon and I. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon and I bathed Digby and Jet the other day. Jet handled it better than Digby. Digby wasn't really about it. She didn't mind the actual thing, just the water kind of freaked her out at first. But. Break them in slowly. You put them up yeah. on the table? Oh, we had them outside, right on the cement outside oh. the barn. It was nice, so. Oh, okay. Less of a mess. Well, the water in the, in the laundry is warm. Mm hmm. Although, always keep your hand in it when you're working with the dogs, because sometimes it changes temperature very quickly. So if you keep your hand in it while you're working with the dogs, it means it gets hot or cold. Alright, this I just ran and ran after my Dane, recent rescue, in my alley after she got out. I know it's not good to run after a dog. Do you have any suggestions on ways I can train slash work with her to get her to stop and respond to her name? Um You don't chase a dog. Yeah. They'll run. Many times if you turn around they'll follow you. But that dog apparently needs many, many more cookies and can feeding and spoon feeding. Mm -hmm. You call them to you, you feed them, and you let them go away. Yeah. If you always call them, put a leash on and go somewhere, they're not going to come to you. So it's a question of calling them, keeping a pocket full of cookies. Yeah. So and sometimes in that process, sound angry, like, let me come. So, ah, just like you would be if you're nervous and excited and they're running off someplace. So, Get off me, you know. Um, so sound angry, then give him a cookie and let go. Mm -hmm. What kind of shampoo do you use? It is a, is it a mixture of things? Um, what is it? The water Bio shampoo? Or no, you're not using oh, water. No. no. What is that? I don't know the name. Bio groom is what we use because we have so many white dogs. Mm -hmm. And it mixed with a little bit of water. And then with water to bathe them. See, she's so good. <laughs> I like these drugs. <laughs> Regina said Regina is her favorite for obvious reasons. <laughs> Understandable. Oh, um. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's all? No, um. Okay. We still got six minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to 
want to sit here? Oh, yeah. tell a funny story. Um, see, now I forgot all the funny <laughs> stories. Um, I don't, yeah, no, I'm, this is where you come in and help. About Lainey <laughs> and that walk we took. Oh, there's something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, shampoo with oatmeal is good. I've, I've used that before on my old dog. Shampoo with oatmeal. You heard of that? Um, yeah, we took Lainey, my dog, my other dog, Maisie, and who, and Uchins. And Uchins. <laughs> we had a little pug, too. And, um, we were running, like, I just decided to just run a little bit with Lainey. But then when I stopped, she kind of got scared. And it was me and my other, my roommate. And so when she got scared, she decided to run around us. She just, like, corralled us all with her leash and tied us all up. <laughs> and then wanted to, like, keep going somewhere. And we were like, oh, no! <laughs> it was quite a scene. In the middle of, like, this nice park. <laughs> all stuck together. Can you talk about, um, per talk about some personality traits of some of the pups? Alright, um, well, Kara, Kara, I had her, she was hanging out in the barn. She's funny, she's very shy, she's kind of, like, n nervous, but she's very sweet. You know, she kind of reminds me of Lainey. Lainey is very odd. Where she meets new people, she likes to not approach them right away, but just observe them from a distance. So she'll just kind of stare at people, and I, it's, it's odd, I tell people, you know, when they come over, I'm like, don't mind my dog just staring at you. Like, it's not, she's not trying to intimidate you, she just, she kind of has to check you out, make sure you're a good person, before she can decide if she wants to be your friend. <coughs> um, oh, we got two new. Um, and... Regina is funny. Regina kind of comes off. She's more, she's kind of like a queen. I call her like Queen Regina. Kind of a princess, you know. Carries herself in that way. Um. Um, where can I find find out about this litter as far as parents, how many puppies? What's this one? Where can I find out about this litter as far as parents, how many puppies? Isn't there a, is there a link? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get the last point. Where can I find out? About this litter and their parents. Oh, what's on a piece of paper there? I mean, on that thing? This thing? Oh. Maybe it's Sorry. not. Sorry, Sorry, honey. She's um. like, I am disturbed. <laughs> I didn't mean to I disturb mean, on you. on the floor, there's a green box that has, like, SDP links and stuff. Oh, yep, they're it up here on the top, too. These guys made it. I don't know if you can see it. You can hold it up. Sorry, Steve. There is a... Go ahead. You explain that. Yeah. All right. So on the Explore page, um, if you scroll up from the question box, there's Explore Info, and you can click on SDP Related Links and Information. And if you scroll down, it will say, um, like, the family trees, and there's one for... Um, by father and by mother. Um, where did it go? Um, yeah. So there's Juliet's latest B and W trees by sire and by dam. Um, or dame. My bad. Um, and it has the up to date lists it's of not puppies. That woman, she knows them. Is that where all the uh, uh, mail calls are? Um, on here? I'm not sure. I think so. Probably. Somewhere there. <coughs> yeah. Oh, right on the top, Melcom. Where? Yeah, you just went over it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right there. Explore King? No, no, no. Mail no. call, there we go. <laughs> Quick links. I'm smart. <laughs> oh, wow. They're like up to date. They mostly. are up to date. You're supposed to be explaining this. The people on there can't see what you've got on the screen. So okay, so um, one now of the... Get to that again. Okay, again, um, on the Explore page, there's a green box, and I clicked on SDP Related Links and Information. And at the top, there are quick links. So if there's a mail call that you've missed or you want to go back to a mail call from weeks ago, um, you can click on the Mail Call tab, and there are the videos with... The trainer talks at the beginning. Um, it goes on and on. This woman has oh more gosh. stuff on there. Oh, 
You can go all the way back to 2000, August of 2013 if you want. Start watching now. <laughs> if, you, if you have some free time. Um, and there's, you can find out about dog fests on the related links, um, puppy IDs, there's a link to the Service Dog Project website or the Daily Doggy. Um, and a bunch of. miss much, period. Yeah, everything you want to know. See if anybody else has any more questions. Go back to that. Bit. Sorry, I took your seat, Liv. Um, do you take dogs out in your car? Do you want to come back? I do sometimes. Um, is there one pup that you were working with that has a certain problem or task you're working on? Um... No, I think right now I'm just working on the same general thing. We just walk through, like, the hotel and stuff, work on stairs, one step, back up, if, like, Cindy. Did you do the elevator there? I haven't, I haven't done the elevator yet. Oh, I did one time with Seagram. We waited for the elevator, and then it opened, and this little yappy dog came out, like, full throttle at Seagram. Ooh. And then Seagram was like, oh, and then she went, and I was like, so I had to, like, step between, and this, and this people were like, laughing as they walked away and I was like mm, this is like <laughs> the things that I would say that I can't say to you right now. Well another thing with air, with elevators, you don't ever want to push the button and then stand right in front of the door because if the door opens and there's somebody in there that's about to have a heart attack anyway and they take one look at you and that dog, they're going to just <laughs> drop in their track. So when you push the elevator button, I always try and get away from the elevator mm -hmm. so Give that it room. doesn't happen. A little happy. Yeah, right. I just made that, but the, the rope is kind of dusty and dirty. That's from the tea tent, so she's going to have to boil it and clean it up. Throw it in the laundry. Oh, you use hot glue, isn't it? What? Hot glue? Like a hot glue gun? It does have the tail end of it's glued in. Only because it's going to be chewed by a dog. Right. If it was just going to be a keychain, I wouldn't bother. But. <laughs> um... Are any of you girls hoping to become veterinarians? It really is. Um, it's a maybe. I don't know. Trainer is a lot more fun than dealing with sick dogs all day, probably. <laughs> That's um, true. But I'm taking all the prereqs that I'm going to need for vet school. And in the fall, I'm interning out of that clinic. Ooh, that would be exciting. Where? In Saco, Maine. Saco. So you'd be trying for Tufts. Self-said cool? Maybe, whatever I can get into. <laughs> I, have, I don't have any cold. I used to, but I don't. Where is sweet Gretchen? Who? She's Gretchen? in the condo. I don't know. She's in the condos. Is that where she is with? Yeah. So they have the patients up here. Finley and Neko are up there, too. That's because we have the... Mm-hmm. I see you on back here. <laughs> All right. Oh. is a great person. That it is. A lot of learning experience here. I learned, I think, more in my summer internship here last summer than I did, like, in any of my classes. A lot of, lot more learning, hands on. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. It comes at you pretty quick. Mm-hmm. Comes at you pretty quick. Yeah. Next problem is, I know that there's boxes of mail down there, and I don't have it. In the, oh, in the purple house. house. Oh. In the mail department. Okay. Really you can it. make a card if you like. Okay. All right. Um, oh, we are four minutes over. It is oh 5.04. Okay. Well, that's all right. We can manage. <laughs> well, thank you for listening. <laughs> okay, so what did everybody think of that deal? <laughs> They'll all tell me. Okay. You know, I, I never really explored this thing too much, this green box up here. 
It does take you right to the daily doggy, doesn't it? Huh. All right. Well, Very strange. So, Haley, you're staying. Oh, she's she not here. Um, oh, she was a good thing. She's staying overnight, apparently. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For her first overnight. Well, that'd be fun. I'd love to do an overnight, but not tonight. I've been up since 4.30. Okay, so when we got that Cummings um, award, uh, grant, they are having some sort of an award party next Thursday night. And I will be going with Anne and probably Bentley. Um, Bentley is not 100%, so I will just have to be very careful with him. It would not be very nice if he bit the people that gave us the money. That would not be, that would not be a good thing. So I will have to be very careful with him, but uh, he, should be, he should be all right. He's fine as long as I, I keep people away from him. He would never charge anybody invite anybody but if somebody comes over and clobbers all over them then he, he would he would not like that so I'll just have to keep people away from him how to slow down the symptoms of aging I've got the wrong thing up here what happened to my there it is okay There we go. Very interesting trainer talk. Oh, good. Okay. Thanks, ladies. Very interesting to hear things from their perspective. Great job for her first one. Olivia did fantastic. They've all just now gone to to pick up the mail. Good, good teacher, Carly. Good lesson for them in public speaking and grammar. <laughs> I, 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 I'm one of the. I don't like this. Can I do this? Can I do that? No, don't. I got mail. I got mail. Yep. Okay, you got mail. You got mail. Let me put that down on the floor. I just finished that book. That is an excellent book. Book. I highly recommend it. Okay. So here we have something from Virginia, Zionsville, Indiana. Zionsville, Indiana. Supposed to have some rain up there today, I think. Okay, some very nicely cut hoop pickers. Oh, it looks like these may be aha Republican. Okay. Oh, and John Kasich. Very good. These are these are political things that have all gotten cut up. Couldn't happen to a nicer project. There we go. Oops, there you go. Okay, and this is Shirley Mass. Hmm. Okay. Oh my, we are not veterans.
Huh, okay. I apparently oh this is Shirley Mann. Okay, she it's written it's written in a great big long paragraph, so I really can't spot the things I really need to look at. Get my hat off your head. You be careful. Okay. Um There we go. This has got to go out in the second door out there. Do you know where that is? Spalding. Spalding. Spalding, Spalding. Oh, okay. Huh, cerebral palsy. Okay, this is another one's got to go out there now again. There you go. Keep going. You're doing fine. Um, this is from Stratford, New, Stratford, New Hampshire. So, oh, for dog fest. Okay. Okay, so I have to put the phone number on here so that we have that. Oop, the other end of the pen. 603. Okay. And that checks. I'm separating the money from the this has got to go. Stuck a drawer out there. Dog fest. Dog fest. Okay. Harold Wanda. I hope they're not drowning. I, I'm 17 inches of rain today in the Houston area. That's 17 inches here and here and here. You know, it's all over. I can't imagine. So here we have Harold Wanda. They don't have any politicians left. No, no politicians today with Harold Wanda. Okay. And we have Krista from Chicopee, Mass. From Chicopee, Mass. Little piece of paper in there. Far side. The top drawer. Is it open? Okay, this is another this is another person who is applying for a dog. Lots of applicants today. Lots of applicants today, yeah. That's advertisement. We don't want that one. So, uh, Simi Valley, California, something like that. Well, that's a nice picture. Oh, my heavens. Linda Kay sent me some poker chips last week. I'm enclosing a check to cover the cost of postage. And chicken bricks, thank you for all you do. Okay, so how many chicken bricks do you think we got? Okay. So that's got to go in here, and this has to have a number on it. Chicken bricks, 10. And that goes in the chicken brick department. And this goes over here. FedEx. Oh, okay, this is an applicant. And she, they were here last week. Oh, I remember. 
-hmm. And so if, if anybody has been here, I always ask them to send a photograph so that I can remember who they are. Otherwise, I don't have a clue. There you go. Oh, that, that's from Georgia. There we go. Okay, put it up here. Gator girl? Gator girl in Tennessee. In Tennessee. Oh, okay. This started the argument about the dryer sheets. Is anybody aware of the dryer sheet department? A couple, a couple mail calls a, a bit ago. Yeah. Somebody put a dryer sheet on their dog which had a seizure. Um, so I said for these dryer sheets, they're supposed to have nothing in them. So hopefully, whoop, we did that. They're sensitive. And that's what Diane. Is that who it was? Yeah, Diane. Diane. There you have it, right there. Okay, I'm gonna put these in here. I'll have that for trash bag. Next. <laughs> right out the pot here. Okay, this is from Milford, Stanley, Lexington, Kentucky. Oh, we got some more dryer sheets. We're only doing well on the dryer sheet department. Yep. Those are the ones for sensitive skin, free and clear. I'm hoping they're fine. The only problem is going to be that I'm having the dryer vented into the arena so it smells better. You know? Oh, my word. We have more dryer sheets. Me now, we I have a lot of dryer sheets. Now, I think we better stop the dryer sheets. This is Laura. Laura Huron. Prom. H R O N. How would you say it? Prom. Prom? Prom. Okay. I hope that big box is full of dryer sheets. We're really going to have a problem. Oh my. Oh, no. oh, isn't that pretty? Uh -oh. <laughs> isn't that pretty? You know, these solid ones are good now that we're having puppies. Because you can see them better. they show up better on the solid ones. These can be for the adult dogs. And there's a puppy one again. Oh, oh. Look, oh isn't that oh. cute? Go hold that one up in the window. Oh. Doesn't have a piece of paper with it. I checked on it here too. Is it here? It just says two. Huh. Huh. Yeah, pretty. Mm -hmm. Okay, Houston, Texas, Office Depot. No, that's the box she got from somebody else. Yeah. She has to have had a label on it, a shipping label. Unless they dropped it. Is that the... Oh, is that the... That's it? That's it? Yeah. Wow. Okay. Where did it come from? Pitney Bowes. Not going to help at all. Okay. So that's... Them. Okay. That's it. That we have any questions to answer. Nineteen questions. Oop. Let's see what we got here. I use all. Oh, I use all laundry detergent. No dyes or perfume. Yeah, that's true. We do that. Today. Having a dump dinner tonight? No. We didn't get organized in time. Um, no, I've still got some dinner left from last night, but I would have to get something in for Grace and everybody else. My dad always said, can you, if I said, can I, in the wrong place. Huh. How many paid employees work there? Not nearly enough, no. Uh, 
Okay, uh, there's a lot. There's a lot. I, I would have to wipe out this thing and get to my computer screen, but no, but with all the part-time people and all the overnight people and all that sort of thing, I bet you there's 15, 20, something like that. There's an awful lot of volunteers. What about if Bentley has this service dog vest on, then maybe people would not have... Are you kidding me? They come over to kind of take a hold of him and say, let me read this thing on his back, <laughs> which says don't touch, you know? No, they, no, it, it's up to me to stop the people. People do not look at his vest at all. He always wears it when he's out, yep. It does help me. It, it, it's basically my handle on him, too. Olivia was awesome, and thanks for the grammar lesson. You getting up? You getting up? Bailey's up? Uh-oh. Well, she's going to want to get over here. Is that all ready for her? Yeah. Want a drink of water first? There you go. Get a drink. Good girl. No, you're not getting her out of that bed. You're going to have to take a drink. You have to go out? Going to have a drink of water. Okay, did everybody get out of her way so she can get over there? She's not going to understand that. That was my ver my maternal grandmother's pet peeve, may or can. I've never seen Bentley aggressive in the house or with volunteers. He's not, but he's panicked. And a dog who's panicking is not, not terribly reliable. Loved it. The kids are learning so much. I think it's wonderful to give them this opportunity. Well, that's okay. And work them. How was Carlene's day? Carlene's day. What on earth did I do? I tried very hard very hard to get a Shell gasoline card that was good only at Shell stations and only for gasoline. Because I've decided to put one in each car and therefore we can keep our gas expenses um, in a more logical way. Right now we're using American Express for everything and that's just very confusing. Bentley, no, Bentley. Bailey. A Bailey rather. Bailey. Come on. Come on, Bailey, over here. Over there, Bailey. Gonna have to go over there. The girl. Go on. You'll make it. She won't make it. Go on. Go ahead. It's okay if it smells like chaos. Get up there. Up to Bailey. Ba no, you're not getting in that one. <laughs> you can do it. Good girl. Good girl. You oh, made it. Girl. There you go. Good girl. That was good. Need a little hand there. I, my day was fine. I, I don't think I left. I don't think I left the property. Oh, oh, a couple more. I wouldn't use a dryer sheet on my dog. Don't apparently because apparently some dogs are allergic to it. I never know when to use I versus me. You just have to take out the other person in yeah. the sentence, and then if it sounds right, like I am doing this, not me is doing this. Right. She, her, she was bad with the me and me and she are going to do this. Right. Yeah. That was the double bad. 
there should be Sheila or whatever, and I, not Sheila, you know. Yeah, okay. On to the next problem. Somebody else has an idea here. Let's see what they say. You, you would not say me is going. See, that's what this person said. Take out the other person from the equation. Family and I, okay. Well, here's the person. I is subject, me is object. See me. I see me. Well, there's one. I see me. Not me see I. Ah. Did you read Janine's blog of her adventures unloading the dockies and the bra? Oh, what a... No, I have not read Janine's blog. I have no idea where she is. I'm saying the dryer sheets may not help with the bugs. I don't want to help with the bugs. I'm just trying to help with the laundry. <laughs> Unscented also won't help with the arena spell. I know that. Whiteboard one and two. Surgical cases are doing very nicely. It's Katie off for a while. Katie reported that she is now pregnant. So she's, she's got the deal with that. I don't, I don't know. I don't think she's coming in tomorrow. I don't know. But she cannot work here, though, I, with the pregnancy. Uh, this, is, this is called hazard work or something. Um, she may come down and volunteer and play with the puppies, but uh, etc. As a poo picker, cutter upper, it pains me to see that nice big FedEx envelope to go to the wastebasket and all the dog cookie boxes. Oh, well, I know they'll store it. Huh. <coughs> yes, thank you. Okay. Uh oh, two more. Always put yourself last. Did you get a grant for the intern? We have gotten several of you people chipping in money for the grants. Um, we've had several checks come through that were specifically labeled for the grants. And Linda does have that. She is keeping track of it. I think we're all set for a while. Plus the fact this Cummings grant will. That'll carry us through the summer. See if we can't turn these children into working trainers. Okay, I'm going to quit. That's it. That's it? No more. Uh, bye! bye.